Well, hello there, guys. This is Real Killer Gaming, director of Red Light Broadcasting, and today I will be showing you what is Rage Fire Chasm. Rage Fire Chasm is a low-level dungeon, which is for everybody over fi level 15 and up to level 21. Um, now, right since Mist of Pandaria, um, there have been quests for Alliance 2, and uh, these guys came in through the through the portal. And uh, it would be four quests, and um, these four quests, I will show you what they are. Um, so let's get through here. Now, I am tank. I am a monk tank because that is one of the easiest things to be <laughs> while I'm talking, so um, that is what I'm gonna be. Oh, let's go over here. That guy just won a tank for me, apparently. He doesn't need to. Somebody tell that guy that he doesn't need to tank for me. As you can see, there's uh, flame hounds here, and um, they have been here all Mists of Pandaria. And um, let's show them who's the real Rage Fire Chasm boss here. Get at me, bros! I'll throw barrels at you. So um, there's also corrupted hound masters and uh, dark shamans in this dungeon and as you can see we are nearing the first place where um, a boss was in Cataclysm. Uncle Flint he was called. He's no longer there, he's getting eaten, he's dead. So uh, let's get through these mobs. Now um, as you can see one of the quests if you click over these is to get corrupted insignias from, um, from these targets. Um, from the humanoids works and um, as you can see there's our first boss now let me tell you what he does let's just get that guy first hey get at me bro as you can see there's a guy there he's fighting off the wolf and um, that is one of the other quests to rescue five of these guys now that is pretty easy so let us go through the boss here we go so as you can see, he's just a melee hound that will uh, tag you, but um, he can also spit flame at you. So let him see that, or let him do that. Stupid wolf. He can also inferno charge somebody, uh, random, and uh, it will de deal a amount of damage and uh, will do nothing else. So stupid wolf is trying to take aggro. There we had the flame breath. All of his abilities can be. Um... Please take taunt of wolf um, but uh, both of his abilities can be interrupted so he is pretty easy to kill and he won't deal much damage now that's another ranger so let's get on with this apparently there's molten lava here uh, running through I don't I do take damage from it actually um, and I'm not exactly sure how the lava turned up here, but it's there, so um, just don't walk into it with low health or you will die. As you can see, we had a Dark Charm and Acolyte there, two of them. Um, so they also give the Insignias, the Corrupted Insignias. So um, let's get on with this. Soon we are nearing the second boss. Now, um, the second boss is also one of these guys. Um, he's actually a Dark Charmin. And um, he will do a ton of spells, but he isn't too bad because most of these characters or bosses isn't really too bad since it's a low level dungeon. But um, there's good loot in it. So uh, let's go. As you can see, there he is. Alright, somebody from my group just got 1.2k crit, crit, and I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure how he did that in this level. Now let me get back to my start spell page. Let's get to this one. Now, this boss is also a melee damage, but he will also call, cast a couple of spells and he will go into uh, different amounts of phases. So, um, he just cast Twisted Elements on me and um, on Scar again. So, that isn't the bad thing actually. Now he does Shadow Storm, which will uh, make AoE damage in uh, some places, so don't stand there and get a meteor in your head. Just uh, don't do that. 
for God's sake. <laughs> um, so he's also pretty easy, and I just get some new loot. I love it. And we can already see the new boss. He's over there. Now, I don't think this guy is friends of these uh, dark shamans and acolytes. Um, but he is also a quest. And I have no idea why, because he doesn't really seem like a threat to us. Because we are in Orgrimmar. Ragefire Chasms is under Orgrimmar. Hey, I'm the tank here. So let's just do like this. And get started. And I just dinged. What do you say when you ding? Please tell me in the comments. What do you say? Um, so if you don't know what to say, shame on you. Let's go to Slackmo, the boss. Now, he's also pretty easy. He will cast Lava Spit on um, diff different players from the group. Um, and other than that, he will change spot which he is standing in. Um, so, somewhere between half health, he will go over there. Unless, um, unless we're fast with him. But I think he will change. There we go. So let's get over here. Or maybe he turned up there. Dang it. Never seen him go there before. But, um, easy peasy. Let's go on. Easy peasy, lemon sneezy. So one of the guys just fell into the lava over there. <laughs> Not very smart. Uh, stupid fella. Huh. I guess that's the way. And I can <laughs> res him. So he's pretty fucked. That's about low levels. They can't even res. Well, now the healer's doing pretty good. A Pandaren monk. He is healing me, actually, which is good. Um, will we wait? Dot. Alright, um, alright, that guy. Yeah, he has mass resurrection. Um. Boss. Um. <laughs> yeah, there we go. That's easy. <laughs> um, when nobody can rest, you can just go. Let me get these. And as you can see, I do a pretty okay DPS actually, even for being a tank as a monk. And I am holding all the aggro I need to hold, so that's alright. Um, here we go, that's the last boss, Lava God Gordoth. So let's kill him and uh, get rid of this. Now he's not a big problem either, he will impale a target, or not impale, but he will make a big stone appear on a target, a ground rupture, and it will push the target back a bit. Um, now he will also do another spell, that one, which will also shove you back and um, do a bit of damage. Not too hard to counter, um, but this is only low level dungeons, so it's pretty easy. Now, that is Raid Fire Chasm, so um, if you enjoyed this video, um, it would mean a lot for me if you went and uh, liked the video, maybe commented, said G said for me leveling to 17. <laughs> And, um, like I owe you an ale, so, um, thank you for watching, guys. This is the Real Killer Gaming, director of Red Light Broadcasting, signing out. Peace out, guys.